El Molo has the most energy of any concert I've ever done because of Mother Nature. This is a dream come true for me. I've been wanting to play that for 20 years. It was the first time I got the nerve to try it. When you're live outside, outdoors, on a cliff overlooking the ocean, about 100 feet up in the air, Mother Nature is a very powerful influence. It's pretty distracting. <laughs> it's like 37 mile an hour sustained winds. <laughs> Friday night was the first night in my entire career that actually I got rained on. We had to actually stop the show for safety reasons. I could feel this cold air, that the temperature just dropped, and the cold air is hitting from the back, and I know the rain is coming. Okay, it may be a drizzle. I was hoping it would be a quick drizzle and let us go. But then the rain got strong and it gets very dangerous. Sorry, we're gonna have to stop. It's very dangerous. Safety first. Sorry. Now, you have to understand, what we have on that stage is extremely sensitive acoustic instruments that do not like even a drop of water on them consoles, wires, electricity, I mean, this is, water is our biggest enemy. Probably it's gonna last a few seconds. You wanna get up? Okay. Went the way, the lights come down, everybody covered the equipment. Waited, prayed a lot, the rain stopped. It looked outside and the audience was holding umbrellas. And they were having a party. Let's try this one again. <laughs> Not from the very beginning, I like this song coming up. There is also a little saying that we have in Greece. The wet man is not afraid of the rain. And it's not fair, you all got umbrellas. <laughs> okay, here we go. My uh, production engineer called and said, okay, it's dangerous, we gotta stop. It was Russian roulette when we were up there. It was it rained for 30 days before the concert. And it rained the day after the concert. So we really got one day, a Saturday, out of four that we had planned. If we hadn't done it that Saturday night, that show would have not existed. What we didn't realize at the time is that Mother Nature was giving us a gift. Um, it made it difficult for us seemingly but the fact that we did have the wind, the rain, the uncertainty of whether we would complete the concert, and just the feeling, just the feeling of getting pushed by Mother Nature, um, gave us an edge. Then you could see it in the musicians, in all their faces, their performances. They knew they got one shot at really finally completing the task, which to me, it was pretty close to impossible. The impossible became possible. Next time on All Access. Look, oh, there you go. I'm always impressed when people do that. <laughs>